everyone, it's Rhonda here with Flowers and More by Rhonda coming to you today to share with you my Gone Artsy Goodies. Um, lots of new and exciting products in the store that Deb has just added. So be sure to check that out. Let me get that cord out of the way here. Um, she has new flowers, we have glitter, lots of new laces and trims. So I'm pretty excited about all the new goodies and uh, right now I'm going to share with you some of the fabulous products. Okay, first up, uh, these are have been in the store for a while. These are these fun little foam flowers and they come in four different colors. You get a white, a cream, a pink, and then this fun little hot pink color right here. And um, I have sprayed these with uh, sprays before and uh, they did quite well. So, you know, if you want to change the color up, you still can. So those are fun to work with. And then these, they're like a chrysanthemum. Yeah, and uh, she has these in various colors. Green happens to be my favorite color. And uh, they fluff up very nicely. And you can spritz them and do whatever you want to with them. Fun, fun. Okay, next we have this fun little clamp. It is uh, the Eiffel Tower. It's a new metal piece. And right here it says Paris. So that's a fun little piece. And it stands up like so. Very cute. Fun little thing to add to projects. And she has some new resin pieces. And I think this is absolutely gorgeous. I'm not sure what it is. It kind of reminds me of a uh, carnation. And this is a very pale white mint green maybe. Seafoam green. And uh, she has a couple of various different styles and other colors also in these fun little resin pieces and this is nice and flat so it works well if you're doing pocket letters or layouts or mini albums perfect okay um, next I'll show you some of the beautiful laces that are new to the shop isn't that pretty another dangle lace stunning and then this one is an old favorite that's been in the shop for a while. This one right here. And I've worked with it. A lot of folks have seen uh, my videos for uh, Gone Artsy. And uh, I love to cut it apart and use various pieces of this. And of course, you know, you can dye all your, your laces to whatever colors you want. Your cottons are going to dye darker than your synthetics, of course. And if you'll check out the Gone Artsy fan page on Facebook, uh, there is a section there with all different types of dyeing techniques from food dyes to chemical dyes. Pretty, pretty neat. It's amazing the things you can just use that's in your kitchen cabinet. And then here's another fun little piece you can cut apart and use however you like or need to. And uh, she has a lot of new appliques in the shop. And this beautiful piece, oh my goodness, it just goes on and on and on. Isn't that gorgeous? It is a nice, beautiful piece. And if you sew, this is perfect. all the way down. It's a nice long piece. I'm going to say it's every bit of, let me just give you a rough idea here. Let's see, that's 12 inches, 24 inches, 25, 26, 20, it's about 27, 28 inches long. Nice, beautiful piece. So, again, if you sew, this is probably a must. And if you don't sew, you can cut it apart and use 
whatever you want of it on whatever you're doing. So, very pretty. And that's just one of the new appliques that she has in the shop. And I, I was really thrilled with this one because I love burlap and lace together, just like I love denim and lace together. So I was really tickled when she um, she sent this to me. So this is very new to the shop. So if you do weddings and you're into a country theme wedding, this is great and very cost efficient and affordable. Okay, now this piece, if anyone caught the class the other night, I used it. And here's where I cut it out. And this is it right here. <clears throat> Uh, that I used and so you can cut it apart and use this whoops and then you also have these fun little flowers you can save and use you know on other things these are some of that I cut out because uh, I'm making another project using that and uh, but this has such a beautiful shine so pretty it makes me, it kind of, to me, it gives me kind of that Greek feel. So I like that. And um, again, speaking of the class the other night, if you, this was what I made at it, but uh, this piece of trim is near the shop, so I had to show it on here. And uh, let me get the feathers out of the way, which is also available in the shop. But this beautiful piece of trim, and this I'm sure does not do it justice at all. But it is absolutely stunning. So that's new also. And this, I uh, apologize. This was the only way I was able to demo it. And then I can show it probably right there too. Okay. So that's just some of the new little embellishments and whatnot and laces. So Deb is now uh, going to be doing chipboard pieces and these are perfume bottles and silhouettes and in addition to those uh, she has words this says legacy and this one says heirlooms and they come in different fonts as well different sayings different styles of fonts and she will also have uh, we have this chipboard too got ahead of myself two more chipboards these are a couple more that she, there's these are trees and a little boy and a little girl that you can also uh, create with and these are from fab scraps and then she also has some uh, laser cuts I think these are so pretty and now this set has a butterfly and a heart-shaped wreath and a uh, three-tiered cake and then she has some other styles as well so that'll be fun to work with and then here we have um, some uh, stickers they're easy peel off stickers this would be really cool for a steam project this is just one of a few other designs that she's carrying and these fun little things, it's, um, they're die cuts. Some of them are die cuts and some are, you can just, you know, uh, fussy cut them out yourself. And, uh, this collection has, uh, windows and shutters. Uh, now these are die cut and they are scored and perforated. Uh, there's tags and there's, um, sentiments. There's silhouettes and then there's furniture pieces as well and uh, the little tags are absolutely precious but they're all really neat and there's uh, a few sheets to each so you get a nice little variety of colors to uh, to use as well now these are postcards and they are like the coolest and there is let's see two, I think there's nine three four five six seven eight nine yes and they're all Paris and London themed but they have a really cool coating on them and I don't know if that'll shine yeah there it went 
but they got a really cool coating and all the corners are rounded which I just love that and so they'd be fun to use on projects or mail them to someone time you're in Paris <laughs> whichever you want to do but those are really neat and uh, Deb has got some metal embellishments also to the store and these are uh, this is a frame and I love metal embellishments they're like an addiction so they're really fun to do and then you can add you know different color to it with um, your like your uh, rub and buff and things like that so yeah and then she's also got some new blings and I think these are just so fun to add to projects and uh, she's got some reds in which would be perfect for your Valentine projects and then this cute little shadow box I think it's a darling great for gift giving put together a nice little shadow box for someone and then you've got the little to protect everything inside nice little size love it so that's another newbie. Now, um, I used one of these at the class the other night, and they look like big giant Q-tips. Pretty cool. Uh, there is an extra fine grit and a medium fine grit, and these are great to use on little small projects, especially if you're working in little small areas. And two, you don't have to swipe the husband's sandpaper. <laughs> so you got this all to yourself. So I thought these were really cool and they're disposable so when you're done you just toss a little stick away unless you find something creative to do with it. And then these are little alpha stickers. Uh, they have bling on them. Really cute. Rather festive. I have them upside down. So those are new to the shop. Very cute. And this fun stuff, I've never worked with it, so um, um, it's a modeling film. So uh, you get three 8x10 sheets in this. It says three, but it sure feels like more. Um, it has to stamp or die cut a shape, heat to soften, then shape into white dimensional embellishments. Pretty cool. Never worked with this before, but this is new to the shop. So... Uh, this ought to be pretty fun for all of us to uh, play with. Yeah. So, we'll have to get you all some videos of this and see see what we think. Yeah. Now, Deb was now carrying uh, some paper in the shop from Fab Scraps. And uh, this says Birds and Bees. And uh, this one is uh, Pink Flamingos 2. And this is Fantasy Flight. And this is Fantasy Butterfly. And here are the other sides to these. Very pretty. Green happens to be my favorite color. So I know that's why she sent that to me. And here is this one. And here is that one. Very pretty. So that's just a few of the sheets that she's carrying in the shop. She has a lot more. All right. Now, the last thing I want to show you that uh, I know I'm pretty excited about working with, and that is glitter glass that Deb is now carrying in the shop. And she has several different colors. And this one is a Green Glory Blend. And this one is Gold Fusion. And they come in these little bitty jars. Aren't they the cutest? So when you're done with this, you've even got the little jars to do something with. So that's pretty fun. So that's kind of like a two for one, I think. But it just sparkles so pretty. Very pretty. So anyhow, that's another new item to the shop. Pretty exciting. So, if you haven't had a chance to go over and check out the new products at the Gone Artsy, uh, 
shop, please do so. All the links will be in the bottom in the description. And I want to thank you for stopping by and say hello. And uh, I hope everyone had some wonderful holidays. And I hope they had a wonderful Happy New Year. And we're really glad to have you. And also be sure to check out the um, Gone Artsy Challenge Group on Facebook. You could be the lucky winner of a $10 gift certificate to the Gone Artsy Shop. And the prices are, are fantabulous. So you can get a lot of bang for your buck there. All right then. Well, I want to again thank you for stopping by and taking a peek at all the new Gone Artsy goodies. And I want you to take care and have a great day. And until next time, bye-bye.